Hi guys, it's Beatrix here with Confessions of an Aspie. Today I am doing the Halloween tag. I'm super pumped because Halloween is my all-time favorite holiday slash season. So yeah, today we are doing the Halloween tag because it's my all-time favorite season and yes, it is a season. I can assure you. Question number one. What's your favorite horror movie? Hmm. My favorite horror movie right now. Hmm. I think Friday the 13th is one of my favorite horror movies. Um, also The Fourth Kind. Like, that's probably one of my favorites because, like, I watched that, like, way when I was younger. Like, when I was in 8th grade and it scared the crap out of me. And I loved it. So, probably that or um, Friday the 13th right now. Um, if you were in a horror movie, how far do you think you would get? Five minutes, halfway, all the way to the end, credits. I would hope credits. I mean, I've got a whole plan for the zombie apocalypse, guys, so, um, and I'm not an idiot, don't go anywhere alone, don't go in the basement, like, you know that ad where it's like, oh, let's go hide behind the trees, I was like, no, like, no, I'm pretty sure I get far, I'm not, you don't make stupid decisions, don't split up, don't read, like, some creepy curse in some other language from some book made out of human skin and like somebody like don't go somewhere without like a cell signal or a GPS without like telling a million people that are gonna check up on you like there's so many things like I know the rules of horror movies except for the fact that I'm blonde so I'd probably be like the third to die, but I'd hope to make it to the credits because I wouldn't make stupid decisions. Favorite scary video game, um, Slenderman. Yep. That or like Five Nights at Freddy's, but I like Slenderman. Favorite scary story. Uh, I don't know, I don't read a lot of scary stories. Uh, oh, like, Scary stories around a campfire. Um, I don't know. I used to, like, have this book, and it was, like, Canada's horror story. Or, like, I don't know what it was. It was, like, a horror story. Like, it was just, like, a bunch of ghost stories or whatever. I really liked that. I really don't have, like, one where it's, like, this is the scary story that I love. I mean, yeah, I can't think of one. Sorry guys. What is one unusual thing that you are afraid of? Okay, so one unusual thing I'm afraid of would be like oh, being alone or abandonment. I'm also, well, I guess like the most unusual thing I'm afraid of is like my food touching. Like, can't eat it if my food touches, but that's like an aspy thing, so I guess that's good for this channel. <laughs> but yeah. Um, what is my first memory of Halloween? Ooh. First memory of Halloween, I think, was okay, I dressed up as a rock star. I had like this neon pink wig with like big buns and like braids, and there were like black streaks in it. But then, like, I had and I had like a ripped jean jacket with patches, but then I had like this blow up guitar with like a bunch of peace signs and flowers on it. <laughs> like, it's probably so ridiculous. But I won the costume contest at my school, so that was pretty chill. Yeah. Um, what's my favorite Halloween memory? Probably, like, I think we were in grade 9, grade 8 or grade 9. It was, like, the time where you're supposed to stop trick-or-treating. Um, we went over to my friend's house and we, like, handed out candy for a good hour. And, like, we'd scare the kids because we'd, like, pop up in the windows. And then, um, we went trick-or-treating around the block, just a couple houses, and then we, like, once we got back to her house, we, like, stayed up until, like, 4 a.m. watching horror movies. So, yeah, that was a lot of fun. What's the best costume you've had? Um, 
I'm gonna say my best costume was my Bumblebee costume because um, my name was B. So that was pretty chill. Um, I liked my Rockstar costume, that was pretty cool. My mermaid costume. I know, my mom made all my costumes, like, by hand. So I think they were all pretty sick. Like, I enjoyed them. <laughs> um, yeah, I think those were some pretty good ones. Um, what's the worst Halloween costume you've had? Worst Halloween costumes I've had. Alice in Wonderland, because it was, like supposed to be like some sexy costume but I totally did not make it sexy or <laughs> sexualized or anything because like I was taking it I was wearing it to school in grade 9 oh my gosh that was awful costume uh my half devil half angel costume like it was some like walmart bot costume <laughs> that was like split directly down the middle <laughs> uh okay so these last ones are, which are scarier, werewolves or vampires? Um, I think werewolves, because like, once they're an animal, like, you can't talk to them or anything, you have no idea like what's going on in their minds, like, they can flip. Um, ghosts or zombies? Um, not saying that like, any, either, like, any of these things are scary, but, like, um, probably ghosts. I'd be more freaked out if I saw things moving and I didn't see someone, whereas if I saw something moving and it was a dead person, then, like, it'd be way better. Um, creepy dolls or creepy clowns? Um, honestly, like, dolls and clowns don't scare me at all. Um, I guess, like... Would a creepy doll be like a doll that's a clown? Like, I don't know. Creepy dolls, because my sister had this doll once that was like creepy. But mainly because she left it, at, she got really, really annoyed with it because it was one of those ones you had to take care of. But it like whined and it argued with you. Like, it was the most annoying thing because it was like a toddler age doll or something. It'd be like, no, mommy, I'm not gonna eat my spaghetti. I want cookies. It was like, so she left it out in the rain. <laughs> and I'm pretty sure it's very, like, in my old background because, like, it would still, like, talk and, like, may have been ah, because, like, it just didn't, wouldn't die. And my sister wanted it dead. Ooh, Freddy Krueger, Jason Voorhees, <laughs> Michael Myers, or Leatherface. Um... As much as I said, like, Friday the 13th is one of my favorite Halloween, um, scary movies right now, I gotta say Leatherface probably takes the cake. Like, if I saw him, I'd probably flip shit. Because, I don't know, I don't want to be skinned after I die. Like, if you're gonna kill me, kill me, like, okay, but, like, don't wear my skin as a mask or as a costume, like... It's like Silence of the Lamb shit too, like, no, thank you. <laughs> um, but yeah, that was my Halloween tag. I hope you all enjoyed it, and I hope you all have a very safe and very happy Halloween. I'll see you all later. Bye-bye.